Shalom, I'm Angel. Welcome to Healthy and Heart, and I hope you are healthy in heart, mind, body, and soul today. Um, I'm editing my video for the Azure Standard Hall, and just realized it's been a month. It's been a busy month. Um, I have a brand new niece, um, great niece. And um, I had, uh, we had in this video that day that the Azure truck ran, one of our kittens, one of our rescue kittens had gotten loose. Um, we followed Todd right out the door that morning, which I, we didn't know where he was. We were hoping he would come back. We didn't know. Um, he did come back two days later and spent like two weeks like this. Uh, literally attached to me <laughs> um, and so they uh, the other cats have um, accepted him back finally it took him a couple of days except for Kirby he's our big one and he just he still is pissed off at him um, Gideon's brother Samson he was mad while he was gone and he actually peed in his bed so um, I guess a, a, a literal pee on you <laughs> Um, but, uh, the, our female, our one and only female Siamese, um, she's a dark seal point and she has become like a little mama bear with, with both of them, but mainly with Gideon, who is the one who ran away and escaped. So it's really interesting. She defends him and watches out for them, which is, um, it's, it's quite interesting to watch the animal dynamics. Anyway, um, this video of uh, the Azure Standard Hall, I almost did not do it because I was so sad that my little Gid Man was gone. And um, here's a picture of Gid Man. <laughs> um, I was so, so upset about that. I almost didn't record it, but I did record it. And uh, so you'll notice I am like really, blah, um, really sad in the video. So sorry about that. It is what it is. I was, you know, missing whenever our household was gone and we were missing him. So um, forgive that <laughs> or overlook that um, because it was, it was quite disturbing. So I hope you enjoy this video. Hello, I'm Angel, and uh, welcome to Healthy and Heart. I hope you are healthy in heart, mind, body, and soul today. Um, excuse my face, we're missing one of our little fur babies. Um, this is the Azure Standard Hall for February. I got some carob chips, sweetened carob chips for baking. Not, we don't bake with them, but um, and some mint carrot chips. I got a 12 pack of Oom um Plum vinegar. That's a really good vinegar to use because it's a really good replacement for salt. It is a little salty. I got a three pack of buckets that I'm going to use in the garden. Um, so stay tuned for that video. Um, I got some family size millet and brown rice ramen. There's um, four of the cubes in there. So that was a six pack. And then I got a six pack of the 
Jade Pearl Ramen. And that's what Kelsey's wanting for dinner. Um, I got a six pack of that. I got oof, a six pack of Bubby's Beet Horseradish. Horseradish. Let me see if I can get one of these out. Bubby's Beet Horseradish. I wanted to give that a try because, I don't know, actually I did try that one. I loved it. That's why I got the six pack. <laughs> um, I got a three pack of Harbucha mm -hmm. Goddess. And a three pack of Harbucha Relax. They go under different names on Azure Standard. There's like, they have a different name on the picture and a different name as a title versus what they have on the label, which is extremely weird. Make up your minds already. So I got a 64 ounce of Harbucha Detox. Um, I actually got this one last time and it's pretty good. But I did not do the um, review on that, so that will be coming. Um, I got some Bubby's Spicy Kosher Dill. This is not sealed. It is a raw food. I got some Bubby's Sauerkraut. Also a raw food. I got two of the Bubby's Spicy Sauerkraut. Now... This one has peppers in it, so the peppers are going to have to go to one of the, one of my, one of my babies. I got two of those. I got one of the bread and butter pickles. Aren't those beautiful? I mean, look at the color. So, I got one pack, one jar of that one pack, one jar. Let's see what else is here. I got a ginger shot, wild turmeric. And uh, lemon and cayenne, which I can't do the cayenne, but I'll do a taste test for you. Um, baby kosher dill pickles from Bubby's. So that cloudiness, that is a good ferment. I got two jars of the Oregon Brine Works sour sour Reuben sour Reuben. I got the Wild Brine Probiotic Spicy Kimchi Sriracha, Sriracha, sorry, raw, live, fermented. And then I got the Wild Brine Probiotic Smoky Jalapeno Sriracha. I got Toasted Sesame Seed Oil. We don't use much oil, but this is one that's really flavorful. So if we use oil, this would be one I would like to use. Um, I got some pure carob syrup. Unfortunately, I ordered the pure carob powder mm -hmm. from uh, Azure Standard, but they're sold out. Okay, so I got a lot of the wild brine sauerkrauts because I love sauerkraut and I want to try them all. So this is dill and, dill and garlic. This one is salsa rojo. Uh, red organic kraut balancing act <laughs> uh, and red beet cabbage wait that's not all I also got uh, salsa verde which um, yeah it has tomatillos in it, so I won't be able to eat that one. I'll give it a, I'll give it a try for you, but um, I won't be able to eat that one right now. Um, kimchi, uh, mild kimchi with turmeric. Mm -hmm. Kimchi miso with horse, horse radish. I already did this one. I already did a review on this one. Very good. Love it. Which is why I wanted to try all of theirs. Um, I don't think I got all of them, but also got kimchi spicy Korean. A uh, caraway apple and arame ginger. Arame and ginger. Okay, I got um, two packets of the pow bob, which is um, 
Baobab. I don't know if I'm pronouncing that correctly. Um, it's supposed to be a superfood. Um, if you believe in that. Anyway, um, I do like that in my smoothies. So I got a kefir starter because I did like um, kefir milk yogurt. Um, but you can't keep it alive in, in coconut for very long. So I'm going to give this a try with coconut because it makes a really good tart um, cheese. And then I got two packs of the um, yogurt starters. Mm. They finally have the golden flaxseed in stock. And I got two packs of the five pounds of nutritional yeast because we've already gone through almost all that we have. Um, I believe these are Rubinette apples. It's a bag of organic apples. Never heard of the Rubinette, so I thought I'd give those, give those a try. Mm -hmm. I got a bottle of the ginger lime marinade from the ginger people. I love their products, so that will probably be really good. All right, I got some oxygen absorbers. Um, this one is for the five gallon, this one's for the gallon, and this is for the quarts. So someone had asked me to see if those would seal, so this is going to let me know. Pine up, see if the Azure Standard jars will seal. That's, sorry, I'm a little distracted. Um, so I'm going to use those to, to give it a try and see if it'll seal and keep the air out um, to help keep the food fresh. So I got a one pound bag of pine nuts and a five pound bag of the raw cashew pieces, the small pieces. Let's see, I think, no, that was not everything. I got some more of the bee bomb because I did love that product. I still need to do a review on it. Um, this one is the willow and marshmallow root with rich witch hazel and aloe. So I'm going to give that one a try. This one is the one I actually ordered last time and it's the organic comfrey with capsaicin, arnica, and ginger. That's the one I ordered last time that I wanted. Um, capsaicin has a warming effect um, when you rub it. And it also helps with pain. So um, these are very small. These are like eight dollars, a little over eight dollars, almost nine, for these jars. One jar. This one is the eucalyptus and peppermint. This one is honey and propol propolis. Propolis is a, a product of the bees, also. Um, and this one is patchouli and sage. So I got all the products to give those a try. <clears throat> and oh, that is one more thing. I got a six pack of this. Really, really good. It's lemon, ginger, and turmeric um, cultured coconut cream. Renee's Live. It has probiotic and prebiotic. Um, it's a living food. Uh, the whole container is 590 calories, and good night, I can't see that. Yeah, I can't see that, how much, um, how much fat and whatnot it has. Anyway, it was 590 calories, so that's probably a lot of fat because it's made with coconut cream. Um, the ingredients are cultured coconut cream, coconut filtered water, um, agave filtered water, coconut oil, lemon juice, guar, acacia, lemon extract, vanilla extract, ginger, turmeric, lemongrass, essential oil, and white pepper. Mm -hmm. So, and then it also has the um, active uh, bacterial cultures. So, that'll do it for this month's haul. Pray that we get our little Gideon back. Um, 
I think we think he escaped with Todd this morning when he went for went to work that he ran out the door with him but um, he's nowhere to be found in the house so anyway pray that when he comes back <laughs> God bless you and keep you and give you Shalom until next time God bless <laughs>